Hello there, Pisces. Welcome. This is going to be a new spread that I made up for you guys. And it's digging deep into your person's energy spread. So, let's, I hope you guys like it. So, let's start off with, and this is time. So, whenever you happen to come across this, you're meant to see it. So, your person's feelings for you. Let's see. Ooh. Ace of Swords. They want a new beginning. They want to have a conversation. They want to get to the truth. I think they want to cut off anything that does not belong with anything that interferes with this connection. I have a brand new beginning with you. Okay. How your how your person sees you. Ooh. Well, they see you as a chariot. I get, do you move fast? I mean, there's like a, a whirlwind. Do you <laughs> like move real quick clear to them? Um, this is cancer energy. They, they just see you as like all of a sudden you're here and then you're gone. It's like you, you're, I'm getting a picture of like um, the, the whirlwind just going around, going here, going there, like helping everyone, doing everything and just um, just all over the place. Um, okay, now lessons your person is learning they learn to have hope they're learning about their dreams they learn about their desire and this person also might be in the spotlight for some of you they might be getting attention they might be famous Aquarius energy but they are learning how to fulfill their dreams maybe they weren't doing that before Okay, your person's conscious desires towards you. Yeah, they want to move away from whatever is going on in their life that is not good for them to move towards you. That's what I'm saying. Right here, they started off with this cutting off with, but doesn't belong, having a conversation with you, starting something new. Um, they might want to travel with you or take you on vacation or, you know, do some kind of something for moving. Or they might mom, just move towards you. Maybe move, if you're at a distance, they might be planning to move towards you. Or be in the same town that you live in. Okay, um, your person's hidden desires. They're, they're, um, they're redoing themselves. They're re, um, reevaluating. They're doing a lot of soul searching. And they want to change this. They want their, their hidden desires is to find out more about you and um, to learn more and to heal the situation. Their hidden desires really is to heal this, but they have to do this in steps and they have to do this by understanding themselves better and understanding you. And if they do that, then they can heal this because if they don't know what they're working with, they can't heal it. So that's what they're presently doing. They're trying to heal something here. They're learning. They're learning at this time. They're learning. They're searching. Virgo energy. Okay, what's your person wants you to know? That they're learning some new things. They're starting out and they're trying to learn things. Maybe they're going back to school. Or they're learning something new here. They want you to know that they're they're working on something. They're working on doing something different. Do, learning something new. Okay. And that's um, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. What your person doesn't want you to know. They're mentally conflicted. They're having a real tough time with this separation. And they don't know what to do. They're in their head a lot. Okay. What your person wants to say to you. They want a new beginning. They want to start fresh. And this would be Aries or Aquarius energy. Okay. And potential outcome. lovers gemini energy partnership soulmate and they're trying to manifest this so this series and, and aquarius so this person is working really hard and trying to manifest this connection with you partnership okay now let's clarify this ace of swords your person's feelings for you let's clarify this Ooh, yes, they want the lovers for sure. Coming up again. Pretty significant here. They, their feelings for you is they want this deep commitment. They see you as a soulmate. They want to cut out whatever does not belong and partner up with you. Okay, now, 
your person sees you as a chariot. Interesting. Oh, they definitely want long-term commitment here. They want to, they see you as the potential that th things can move fast. Things can grow with you, I think is what they see. That things can move really quick. They've probably been feeling pretty stagnant. So they fear you, things can grow, things go fast. Long-term commitment. Now, less is your person's learning. They're learning how to apologize, how to be more caring, more giving, more. They want to offer their cup to you, and they're learning how to do this. They're learning, and there might be a little surprise there, too, with that fish coming out of the cup. And this is Scorpio Cancer Pisces energy. They might be younger than you, too. Okay, and why do we have the Six of Swords for their conscious desires? They want this ace of wands. They're going to tell you, you want this new start, this new beginning. They want to grow with you. They want to expand. They feel like you can grow, that you can really um, take off here. They feel like there's a, there's so much that can be... If you two get together, they feel like there's so much growth that can be had with the two of you. Okay, now, your person's hidden desires. We have the hermit. They go back and forth. They're trying to balance things out. They want to. They want to have balance in here, and they want to make a decision. And their hidden desire is to make this work, bring into balance and infinity. They want this forever, and that's their hidden desires. To heal this and have this connection forever. Now, what your person wants you to know. Okay, that they want to bring this back. They want to, you know, this. Connection's dead. They want to bring it up from the dead. They want to bring it back into um, life here. Judgment. What your person doesn't want you to know, and we have this Eight of Swords. Oop. Whoa. Okay. Knight of Cups. Well, I don't know. They want you to know they're the Page of Cups. They don't want to know you're the Knight of Cups. So they're, okay, so this offer, um, they're learning how to become a page maybe they're not ready for the night but really they are a knight they have more love for you than you'll ever know i think scorpio cancer pisces they want um yeah they want to offer you this love i'm just, they just don't know what to do how to do this i guess they're so conflicted and the full card what your person wants to say to you they want this new beginning they want a fresh start take their mask off oh they definitely want you <laughs> want you to know they want to move towards you they want to move on with this they want to move into a better a better um better circumstances better maybe in better environment maybe they want to take you into a new place move maybe they actually want to move to another country or another state or something and they want you to come they want a whole fresh new beginning is what i'm feeling and they're holding on to this they're not gonna let go but let's um let's clarify the lovers here why is the lovers here for the potential outcome Ooh. Well, we get the Hermit comes up again, Virgo energy. But why is the Seven of Swords here? I don't feel like this person wants to take the swords away from you so you can't hurt them, can't... I don't know. Why do we have the Lovers? I gotta clarify this one. Why do we have the Lovers with the Seven of Swords, please? more information on that. Why do we have the lovers with the set of swords? Actually, I should probably move this a little bit. I'll do it that way. Let me get the magician back in here so you can see him. I'd like to see that magician. I like his face. <laughs> Let's see. Why do we have the lovers? With the seven of swords. Wow. Well, this person definitely wants to communicate with you. I don't think they know how to. They're afraid you're going to turn them down. So they're, this is their, this is what they want. They want this, the lovers. They want this commitment. But 
They're worried. Maybe they're worried about someone's gonna steal you away. They're worried about this. Okay, three. Okay, I just think it's four of three of cups. They want this celebration. They're gonna come to you. I don't know what this is with this seven of swords. It doesn't really make too much sense to me. But we have the page of wands, the page of swords, and the three of cups. It's kind of concerning, unless this person's a lot younger than you, that they have all pages. They feel like they they haven't grown up. They're not very mature, or something's lacking here. And that's why they play, maybe they play games or there's something about them that they don't trust that this is going to work. But so Page of um, Wands is Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Page of Swords is Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. And then we have the Fool, which is um, Aries, Aquarius. And there are Three of Cups and we have the Hermit. So this person is just really doing a lot of searching, trying to figure out how to make this work. There's... um. And now this might not be for everyone. It might be for one, 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 two person. This pe person knows how to be sneaky, and um, but they want this connection so bad. They might do whatever they can to try to trick you into this somehow. And that's not going to be for everyone. Please, that's not going to be for everyone. That's maybe one or two. But they're coming across with a lot of messages. They're spying. They're trying to figure out how to do this. That's the energy I feel. Someone wants this beginning so bad that um. They're watching they're trying to send communication and if it's for um yeah it's just for one or two people maybe that someone's getting kind of sneaky or holding back or or um not telling the truth here because they want this connection so bad they want a new beginning okay now let's see what signs could we be dealing with for pisces oh i didn't even see this we have the death card on in here see transformation uh endings new beginnings and transformation i didn't see that popping out there okay that's when i moved the deck so <laughs> okay let's see what signs could possibly be here placements in your chart placements in their chart placements in other people's charts what do we have here we have cancer capricorn aries scorpio leo And Pisces, so here you are. You're in here too. So you could be dealing with these placements in your chart, their part chart, someone else's chart. New people, old people, <laughs> you know, Cancer, Capricorn, Aries, Scorpio, Leo, and Pisces. So if you don't see the sign here, it doesn't mean it's not here. We have all these other cards here. And everybody's here. It's just um whatever is more prominent to come out in it in these cards, but it could be any sign here. Please take what resonates, leave what doesn't. And um let's go on to the letters. 11 letters and then we'll pull 11 names to see what we get this could be your initials their initials first last name new people old people let's see n j f p k S U J again H L T Okay, so letters that we have for today are N J F P K S U J H L T. Now for the names. <laughs> These are the way because I always knock them over if I don't. Okay, 11 names, please, Spirit. 11 names for this reading. 11 names that want to come out. Whoa, okay, we're stopping there. I think I have more than 11, <laughs> but we'll see. right on top showing itself so we'll start with jared so here's jared oh whoop, wait a minute one thing before i name off the names i forgot i knew i was forgetting something i want to see what the, what this person has to say what do we what's the word what's the word what's the word Ooh, excited love expect new start Ooh, so 
So someone's excited about this, and you can expect a new start with them. All right, this that explains itself. I'm not going to go into that anymore. If you want to rearrange the words, feel free. Um, we got Jared, Kathy, Bahida, B A H I D A. We have Sergio. Mm, put these up here. Sergio, Penny, Francis, Magdalene, M A G A D E N E. Oh, M A G D A L E N E. I don't know why I couldn't do that. Kendall, Kendall, um, Alan, A L A N, Kishka, K I S H A. And we have Julie. I'm surprised, only one extra. And Cynthia. Yeah, one, two, three, four, six. Yeah, 12. So that wasn't too bad. I thought we had more than that. All right, so those are the names. So I hope this resonates with you. Please let me know. If it does, please leave me comments. I love you guys so much. And I appreciate all you like, your shares, your subscribes, and your comments. And, um, if you want to get notified every time there's new videos for viewing, you just need to hit the bell when you subscribe. And if you're already subscribed, you just need next time you see a video, hit the bell and you will get an email notification every time I upload new um, emails. So I hope to see you all again real soon. Thank you so much.